So Alvin's here. And we already know that from the letter we read, but I guess getting confirmation or getting confirmed with our good friend Dandelion makes it simpler. Greetings. Greetings. Hello. How can I help the gentleman? Who might you be? Master Handyman at your service. I handle repairs of all kinds, produce strange and non-standard objects, and I'm a capable creative blacksmith and carpenter. Cool. I'd like to sell my gear. Four fletters fangs, this ring, that ring, this sword, that dagger. Hey, he has um he has all the inventory from the order the order guy that I I dealt with. From uh Zima. this, sell that, sell this, sell that. I don't think I'll be needing any more Mahaka Mead or even um, Toussaint. I don't even need the runes. I haven't used them. This is for silver blades. I don't need these anymore though because I never ended up upgrading for them. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay. Um, well, I know if I talk to some of the female peasants... I know one of the, <laughs> one of the female... Yes? Your sister happy? Is your sister happy about getting married? She's happy. She has no concern for her younger sister. Elena doesn't deserve happiness. That's rude. Oh, how I hate that nymphette. Now she's ensnared Julian, a wealthy town merchant, while she wanders about with her nose in the clouds. Don't worry. You'll find a good husband. Better than Julian? Not, whoa, I suffer for the masses, Adam. <laughs> how pathetic. Or perhaps you mean the hermit? Such are my options. Did you see the engagement ring Julian gave Alina? A diamond larger than a pigeon's egg! Calm yourself. Why take her side? Admit it, she's dazzled you. Oh, how I despise her! She'll not have you. I'll give myself to you right now on the nearest rock. <laughs> you nearly need to give me a nicer ring than the one- I don't have a ring at the moment, actually. Farewell. Yeah, I sold them because I had them on my ring, on my fingers. Foolish lasses. Oh, for a son as handsome as I do know, though, that I could... I saw a Rusalka by the lake, but was puzzled Rusalka. to see her bleeding from the mouth. I asked which your bearing card... What did he say? She proved to be a Bruxa, in truth. Hmm. How do you know what a Bruxa is? My grandmother told me of vampires. Tell me. Tell me. The Bruxa is a vampire. A vampire almost as horrid as the Nosferatu. Nosferatu. Bruxa easily lead foolish boys astray. Nosferatu. She has her way with them, then sucks their life away. Sounds like fun. Bruxa give you nightmares. <laughs> Usually they remain silent, though they can scream terribly. Fortunately, they cannot stand garlic. Oh, they're rendered helpless when you cut off their heads. I think most <laughs> creatures... I'll be sure to smack any Bruxa I meet with garlic and decapitate her right away. I'm <laughs> pleased to be of use. Smack her. My father's sword is bigger. Oh. Did she just say my dick was small? <laughs> I think she just said my dick was small. I know exactly what you're thinking, gazing at me that way. Really now. Do witchers prepare magic potions? Yes. Yes. I'm desperate for a boy's. Um. I'm, I'm not a wa. I know you can make perfume. I'm. Well, I. 
I don't think I have a recipe for perfumes. Unfortunately, I can't make her perfume at the moment. Let's head to the inn. I think I have some rings. Because, <laughs> you know, I gotta lay with uh, Celine. Because she's clearly a bit salty about, uh, about her sister gaining favor of merchant boy guy. Iron centipede, wyvern egg, basilisk. Help. Get rid of all that. Three wyvern eggs, I got that. Cool. I can just claim my reward from the innkeeper. Seems like a good thing to me. And there's Julian. Greetings, sir. Greetings, spacious tavern. What? You think everything's small in the country? I meant no offense. <laughs> How can I help? Uh, I saw your notice. I saw your notice. Ah, I need wyvern eggs for my famous omelets. Well, I got them. Here are three. Wonderful. Here's your coin. Thanks. Um. Welcome to my greetings. If you're weary, re I will make yourself at home. Thanks. May I help you? I need... Farewell. I need my inventory. <laughs> uh, one, one thing. thing. Yes? My inventory. Take a silver ring. Actually, I'll just take it all. Take it all. Okay. Oh. Hit the wrong button. Yes. Save. Gambler. Let's go and deal with Celine, given the opportunity. I have to find her, though. I bring trouble. Yes, I do. Because I'm Geralt and death follows me all around. He's known as the... The Spirit of the Wild Hunt. And since, you know, the Sword of Destiny has two blades, I'm one... or er, two edges. I'm one edge, and the other is death. Or death follows me like... Something. Yeah. You'll I hope the elves leave this place as soon as possible. No, that's unforgivable. Oh well. Let's go. Actually, let's. Oh, yeah, she's over there. Just because I want, I want to get my my cards. I want to collect cards. Yes. I have the ring. I have the ring. Show me. Funnily enough, she accepts any ring, even a shitty silver ring. That's the ring. So be it. I'll show Alina I can have any man. But. Kiss me. All right. <laughs> yep. Just, you know. Just, you know, have the sexy time with any woman. My old Can you tell me about, um... How untrue that revenge tastes better served cold. How untrue that revenge that tastes better served cold. How can a lady of the lake in rapture all when I possess her? Old, you don't look if old. If we pour sorcerer's poisons into the lake, our troubles with the fish people will end. Why don't you just try to make peace with the fish people? They're really that much of a problem. I know exactly what you're thinking. Gazing at me that way. I hope the elves leave this oh. place as soon as possible. She's not the the uh, perfume lady. Tobias Hoffman? 
Yeah, by a soft. Flowers. What can we do? What can you do? Greetings. Greetings. Hello. What be your moniker? Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. Lucky to have two witches visit us. Ha <laughs> ha! I, Tobias Hoffman, am the village chief. Ha <laughs> ha yourself. Oh, Beastie home. Beta? What brings you here? Beastie Beta? Um, any work for a witcher? Any work for a witcher? A creature looking like a fish with legs appears by the lake. They say the crypt in the fields is home to a beast. It has huge teeth, resembles a dead mother-in-law. <laughs> Horrible, they say. Any reward for these creatures? Bring proof, and I'll be generous. Tell me more. About what? Um, any non-humans non here? around here? Elves live on the shore. Pretty disagreeable lot. I thought to give them leftover food. They looked at me so cold I nearly froze. They're a strange bunch. Still, I've enough to do here in the village without worrying about them. Okay. I heard there's going to be a wedding. I heard there's going to be a wedding. Yes, my dear daughter Alina is marrying a gallant, hard-working, and honest fellow. You know the joy that finding a good lad for your daughter brings? No? Thought not. Fighting is all your kind thinks about. That's not quite true, but... Listen, got any jobs for a witcher? There are more urgent matters. We'll need... Okay. Talking about the Vodianoi. I wanted to talk to you about the Vodianoi. Vodian Julian oh. is in charge of that business. Vodianoi. That's he pushes treasures from the lake, renovates them, and sends them to markets in Besiba. Okay. Farewell. I don't think I have. All the people I've slept with. All the people. All the people. <laughs> All the people. <laughs> Quite a collection of. Collected. <laughs> Although apparently Triss, you know, I think I did her at the beginning. Not appearing. Alvin Baragon, Ripples, Alp, Basilisk, Devour, Giant, and Witcher Secrets. And some fangs. I think I need a Bruxa fang. And... There's two more fangs I need to get, and then one tooth. You'll only bring trouble. Can I... Oh, shit, wrong side. I dreamt of a world encased in ice. Alina. We gotta go talk to her to find Alvin. Good morning. Hello. Greetings. I'm Geralt the Witcher. Dandelion once sang a love ballad about a witcher. That's How me. How heartwarming. Are witchers like knights, struggling against evil and villainy? Um. Uh, yeah. Dandelion, I'm sure, described my profession realistically. The ballad was romantic. Lovers bound by destiny. Unable to meet. Romantic indeed. Mm. I'm to marry soon. What brings you here? Heard you have my son. You taking care of Alvin? Yes. He has such beautiful, big eyes. Mm hmm Sadly, my husband-to-be won't adopt Alvin. Can mm -hmm. I speak to Alvin? Yes, he'll be in the village, or helping around the house. Farewell. Wait, I have a request. If you happen to pass by the inn, would you be kind enough to look in on my fiance, and perhaps see if my sister there he is. Selena can be found <laughs> There's Alvin. anywhere? Your fiance is spending time at the inn. We're, We're not there. speaking. He's very irritated. We argued about Alvin. Arguing already? Julian wishes us to have our own children. He wants to send Alvin to the Temple of Melitella, or to be trained as a Witcher. You'll find him at the tavern. I Why see. a Witcher? Can't train Witchers anymore. Kind of rude. 
Ah. Tell you the world's blizzard, the white frost, time of blah blah blah. Yeah, this is stuff to do with people like Alvin. Hi, Geralt. I have a new home. Oh. It's nicer than Vizima was. It's just that I missed you. You like it here? I, I do. do now. Are we gonna kill monsters together? Alvin, fighting monsters is very dangerous. Promise you'll avoid it whenever possible. I promise. There are elves around here. One is really beautiful, but she argued with Mr. Tobias. Can we play kill the elf? What? Boy, I really need to talk to you and Alina. It's not Alina. All the kids play it. I'm always the Grandmaster. Grandmaster? We'll right now I have to speak to Julian about Alvin. Am I about to make... Oh. Greetings. I'm Adam. Hello. Geralt. I strive to compose a love poem for my beloved Alina. Ask Dandelion the poet. Supposedly he's pretty good. <laughs> he said love would inspire me. He busies himself performing a diversionary maneuver. A maneuver? He's caught in the miller's daughter to make Miss Arlene jealous. Clever that one. Like a fox. Can I ask you something? Yes. Um, if you're in love, she's about to you're in love get married, Lena. you know? You know she's getting married. I love her secretly, so you must be discreet. Kind of said it straight out. An obstruction to true love. Why but did you tell me in anyways? I'm a random dude, you just <laughs> spilt your beans into my hand. Anyways... Um... Hmm. There's one of these peasant ladies. I... What did these... There's one of these ladies you could talk to and chill. He'll give you something. I'm Yeah, I can't make the potion or the perfume. Because I don't have a recipe for it. I don't actually need to make it, apparently. I need to have it, but I don't have perfume on me. I think she gives you um a potion recipe or something. They usually give you something for Whatever. A witcher. <gasps> a witcher. You'll only bring trouble. Oh, for a Why are you telling me? Why not? Wads of paper. So Okay, so I'm gonna end the episode here. So I'd like to thank you all for watching. I hope you stick around for the next episode recording session thingy, which will be. I don't know, sometime soon. I don't think I'm going to do a third recording session, like I said in the last session, because I recorded an hour with that session, so I don't need to compensate. But anyways, yeah, I'll see you then. Bye-bye!